and welcome back to the Three Houses Boys Only Run. So today we are in Chapter 13. We have reached the time skip. Dimitri is edgy and I am right here. Um, so this chapter, I'm just going to say it, it's my least favorite chapter in the entire game. Um, we get the blue lines back and that will include Annette, Ingrid, and Mercedes. Um, so we really don't have all of the useful units in the world. Um, so let's just get started here. I like to... D Dimitri lost his horse because, um, the game wants me to make him, like, his, um... What's my strategy? His, um, like, cannon or whatever class. Um, so I'm just gonna dismount you and then... Yeah, our stuff is refreshed. My hit rate is really garbage. Um, hmm. Yeah. I really want to burn through the creator sword. Uh, I don't think it's that bad of an idea. We can just rest. Um, but yeah, one of the reasons I really hate this chapter is because this game is really like sandboxy. Um, and just well, you have the convoy, it's no big deal. Um, this game is really like sandboxy, meaning that you can pretty much do whatever you want. You can take any team of units throughout White Cloud section. Um, you know, and make them to gods. And this chapter comes along, it's like, well, yeah, you, uh, you made all these, you know, this army, or you have all these units you're training, and, uh, if you didn't use your original team, you're kind of screwed. I know that's, like, really detrimental in, like, maddening mode, um, if you want to do another team and, like, your, your initial team isn't trained up, this chapter could be borderline impossible. I actually thought in my own maddening mode run that, um, like, I could not get past this chapter. I had to basically, like, have my, um, I had female Bios as a, uh, a Falcon Knight, and I pretty much, um, did what I'm doing now, um, unmount her to avoid the bow weakness, and then just leave her in the woods, uh, just praying for lucky dodges and hits, pretty much. And then Claude was a Wyvern, and I just, well, Claude, I think, has that class, um, by default, and he just kind of flew over here and hid. Um, but that's why I don't like this. It's kind of like, it's very anticlimactic in a sense because you, you know, you can do whatever you want in the game. And then here comes this chapter. It's like, oh, well, no, you can't. You have to use, like, you know, the Blue Lions team. And my type of run like this that is not, like, extremely detrimental, obviously. Um, because my units, I mean, I did train up all the Blue Lions boys. We do have some units just, like, you know, sitting around. At least we keep our, um, gambits. And I didn't, like, use them at all last chapter. Um, so I'll help Byleth out a little bit. I think Ash and Gilbert will spawn first up there, and then in the bottom corner, um, Annette and Mercedes, and they might be in some trouble. Uh, no. Yeah, you're not gonna do anything to Dimitri. Eventually, I too will fall. Um, that could be useful, but um, there are healing points in this map at that top area, that little like green glowy area. I will probably have to sit people on. And here comes Gilbert. Um, we're not gonna really be using him at all this run. Um, okay. Oh, and these two are here. Yeah. Um, they're at level, what, like, two and four? Um, they're just gonna kind of stay there. Maybe I can send Dimitri down that way to help out a bit. I'd be honored. Um, luckily Ash has his items refreshed. He'll be able to fly in and out of here. here. I mean, like every other map in this game, it lends itself really well to flyers. And Gilbert can just sneak in there. Um... Just for some better hit rates. And then Dimitri, you want to go and kill that guy. I really love time skip Dimitri, by the way. His, um, I don't know, I just like the edgy boy of him. The edgy, like, attitude. I, I don't know why. It's silly, but I, uh, I guess I like Edgelords. Um, Byleth is kind of not looking too hot down there. Going to 
Yeah, luckily the game is generous enough to give you all this stuff. And we still have our goddess ring on. Um, Dimitri, you, uh, I think you want to help out the girls down here. Just a bit. Is that going to pull all these guys? I hope not. Another victory. Just get you out of here. Um, and then Felix, Ingrid, and um, in case you're not familiar with Blue Lines, because I know this is like the same map in Golden Deer, but in Blue Lines, um, Felix, Sylvain, and Ingrid will be in the top over, um, over like here they spawn. And Ash will also have to get some chests. So once again, I um, know, uh, like I said in uh, back in chapter not eight was it the Remyer Village? Um, his personal skill isn't that useful, but you know, in a chapter like this where you might not even be really prepared, I find it to be um, helpful. Just because we can get these chests without having to worry about. Well, you know, missing them. Um, Dimitri, why don't you just aggro this guy? You two will wait. I'd like to get Byleth in there, but I feel like he's gonna die if I leave him by everything. Hmm. Bravax, maybe? Yeah, it's just throwing us all the items like in the world at us. Uh, okay, you really need to uh, kill these dudes. It won't be in vain. And luckily, Byleth himself can do a bit of healing on his own, so it's not as problematic. I have no idea what Gilbert's combat arts do. I never use him except like in this chapter. Um, and that'll do it. Did they join yet? I think we'll say something, but I always have to check. You were unprepared. I feel like Dimitri has like an absurdly high crit chance in this chapter. Every time I play this map, he just goes on a rampage. I mean, it, it fits for the story, but there they are. Um, it's just weird, in my opinion, that he does that. Um, okay, so this is the point where let's see if we can do anything. Yeah, we can do nothing. Well, you can curve shot this guy, I guess. Mm, don't really like the crit rate. Um, yeah, not a whole lot these two can do. I'll just leave them over there until the rest of us can arrive. Um... Here, Dimitri, what do you have on you? Right, we'll go ahead and burn through it. Um this team here. Now how does Ash do against this stupid assassin guy? Not that well. Um, I'm gonna mount up Byleth. Actually, um, that. Just try and bow him, I guess. No. Yeah, I don't want Felix, like, taking a crit. Ready when you are. Not you, Ingrid. <laughs> Not you. Um, I don't really want you, like, eating a crit from this guy. Yeah. 
Um, we're just gonna stay put. And Dimitri can handle himself down here pretty much. See you in the eternal flames. Uh, we don't need that. Helpful advice. Um. Oh yeah, you're gonna. I think we can talk and attack. And of course, we'll talk to Ash because he is best boy, so we're obligated to do that. I must steal myself. Might actually have to have Ash come over here and save these guys. Maybe Gilbert. Alright, Dimitri. Hurt him. There you go. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to do a lot of item sorting out whenever this chapter is over. Luckily, I do get a break until the, uh, um, the next one, because this one just jumps in right from the last one. In case you weren't, like, well, I'm sure most people, like I said a couple times, uh, I'm sure most people who do lines in Deer Route know that, and I think from what I remember on Church Route, it's the same way. I, although I think you get Sedith here. Some range of two things. I'm just gonna leave you there. Um, Dimitri, heal up a bit. I think there are. <clears throat> Oh, excuse me. I think there's four chests in this map. There's like two by that door. Not Not so fast. Child's play. The hit rate. Well, he is in a tree. Um, y'all are moving out, I guess. Yeah, there's two right there, and then there's two behind this fortress, and Gilbert is poisoned. Yeah, one right there, and then one right there. Honestly, oh, this Dimitri I can just run right, and I think when I, when I originally did this, my guys were only like at level, there's a stupid bow there, my guys were only like at level, um, like 25 or something, I don't know why I was so underprepared, but I was. Um, alright, Ash, can you get rid of this guy, please? I don't like his crit rate on Felix. And then we can finally move in these guys to help us out. Um... Nope, we can't use her, even though she would be useful to break the door. <laughs> um, I think I might just have you go over here and start picking at this guy. This could turn the tides. Not a range of that bow, is it okay? And I might send Gilbert back on the, uh, the heal point. Uh, Dimitri, did you go yet? Yes, you did. Like, Dimitri's pretty much the one-man army here. And I forgot that that was really stupid. Ryloff isn't doing so hot on this map. I feel like his hit rates have been kind of irritating the last two chapters. Ow. And I don't like how you're getting close to my, uh... My, um... And you're poisoned now, too! And you're poisoned now, too! Yeah, you're getting close to my, uh... My guys right here. Um... Yeah, we don't have anything that can help. Files, can you like actually hit, please? You're really irritating me right now. Ah, <laughs> uh, Bullion, don't do not need that at all. Like we are swimming in money. Uh, Ash is frozen. Yeah. 
need to get some better equipment on these guys. And let's see if Sylvain can snag a kill. Okay, great. You knew the odds. And another bullion. And Ash can't do anything. Alright, I'm really hoping that guy up there goes for Dimitri. Please. Okay, thank you. Although, to be fair, I guess it wouldn't be the end of the world if Annette and Mercedes died. I mean, I'm not using them. Another door key. Alright. I think Ash... We're gonna get this. Uh, yeah, we're not gonna move. Um, Violet, I think we might just, um, let's see, since Ash is kind of busy, do we have any keys in the convoy? Um, we do. where you can just stay put. Um, what do these guys want to do? I guess they can start working their way up here. I think these guys, like, I don't know where they run, but whenever you get to the, like, second part of this map, they kind of, like, pick a direction to go with it. Well, I don't think he's going to be escaping Dimitri. Or doing damage to Dimitri. Ah, <sighs> Dimitri. Hit you like any better? Uh, we can get rid of that guy, I guess. But now he's just gonna keep picking up Dimitri. I disposed of doubt long ago. Not okay. Uh, all right, Byleth, let's go ahead and get this other chest. Um, Ash, how bad do you get messed up by these guys? Pretty freaking bad. Uh, I don't want this bow to go for him. That's the problem. We're still, like, in his range, though. That's the issue right here. Um, yeah, there's just so many guys around. I might have to have Ash wait until, um, they start moving to go down there. We can pick up this guy. One less assassin is always good. Uh, Felix, do we really want to put you there? I mean, you are Felix. Uh, Alright, we can go for that. One to remember. We don't want Sylvain getting attacked by a bunch of stuff either. Uh, Alright, I guess I'll do for this chapter. Let's pray for Felix. Yeah, as you can tell, I really just don't like this map at all. I mean, at least it's a good challenge, anyway. Um, could be worse. Yikes. Okay. I mean, it moves him out of Ash's way. Maybe Ash can, like, isolate him and pick him off. That'd be... I deal here. <laughs> well, gambling with death right now. You haven't earned my pity. Okay. Um, Bilef, you're still gonna take hits. Uh, Dimitri. Luckily, this guy was stupid and got off of the trees. See you in the eternal flames. Okay, Dimitri, just take on the whole lower half. Um. We 
can go ahead and bonk one of these guys and then get Ash moving. I must steal myself. Yeah, Ash is almost ready to go into the uh, Wyvern Lord. We might actually have to have Felix. Felix is going to have to uh, get rid of this guy. And I'm going to have to get rid of the other guy. All right, next. Balas, your hit rates are like not good, dude. Okay? <laughs> like, they're so bad. Um, I know it's an assassin, but still. Um... Yeah, I don't know which way he's going to run. There are some other guys down here. Um, guess it's all for this turn. I didn't think this map would take this long. Uh, Ash, go and get the chest, please. Can you can't go out of there if I... Go ahead and pick at him. And I'm already there, although I don't think Byleth has the uh, appropriate rank just yet. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted to do. <sighs> it isn't looking okay, um, they're gonna try and get to where they are. Um, alright, Dimitri, I think you might want to start moving this way. safe right there. Um, Dimitri. Just go in here, Dimitri. <laughs> Just go there. Uh, you're actually stuck. Um, Byleth will want to come in here in case we have to swoop around and do anything. Yeah, bringing down Dimitri would take some strategy. I agree, a generic assassin guy. Very, very um, astute ob observation for you to make. Can Dimitri reach you yet? No. I'm just gonna murder you. <laughs> All talk and no action. I think Dimitri might be the MVB here, not really sure. Hey, another free item. We're just gonna go for Dimitri with a barrel full of TNT. Or whatever that is. I don't know. It's kind of funny. I keep thinking I have curved shot on him. Can you please hit? Thank you. One's gonna go to Dimitri. Yeah, definitely. And he has advantage, but Dimitri doesn't care. And another ring. So love good items. Um, a little bit of a difficulty spike, I guess, but um, it's more so because we're kind of limited. Um, as I already expressed my disdain for this chapter, but Dimitri, as um, we expect, does get the MVP. Um, and I will see you for the next one.